everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm super excited to share my experience and offer some valuable tips for those of you who are attending the AWS Summit for the first time. The AWS Summit is a fantastic opportunity to learn more about AWS, cloud computing, meet new people, advance in your career, network, etc. And uh, even an example, last year I attended my first AWS Summit in New York City, it was around July, and it was an incredible experience. Fast forward, less than a year later, I spoke at an AWS Summit, which was the one in Toronto. So you never know what can happen and the journey is amazing. So take advantage of what AWS is offering you. Now let's dive right in. First things first, get prepared. So if you're traveling to the event, you have to figure out about hotel, logistics, food, everything. Although the AWS Summit is free and also they offer lunch during the event, AWS is not responsible for anything else. So they won't pay for anything or reimburse you for any cost that you may incur. Remember that. Next, make sure to register for the event in advance. This event is so popular that you don't want to miss out on a spot. Also, before the event, take some time to explore the event schedule and the agenda. Look at the sessions that interest you the most. There are workshops, there is the keynote, there are so many things you can do that day. So make sure to note down or put it on your schedule because otherwise you're gonna get overwhelmed on the day and you're gonna forget everything. When you're picking the sessions, Think about the topics that align with your interests and also your professional goals. Keep in mind that each session has a level ranging from 100, which is foundational, to 400, which is expert. So if you're just beginning your journey in the cloud, choose the lower levels like 100 to 200. But if you have more experience in the industry, you can go to the other levels. I also recommend you explore the list of sponsors because like that you know better what companies will be there, what, they, what do they do, what products do they offer, what partnership they have with AWS and you'll be better equipped to have a conversation with them at the event. And you never know what happens during these conversations. You may get a referral for a job or make a friend, whatever. You never know. So do your research ahead of time. Now, when the big day arrives, don't fret. There is no dress code, so wear whatever makes you more comfortable and confident. A jeans and a t-shirt is totally fine. Arrive at the venue early, so you can check in and get your badge without any problem. Last year at the summit in New York, there was a huge line in the morning around the corner, so it took more than one hour for everyone to get their badges. So get there as soon as it opens so you can enjoy the whole day without any problem. Now when you're at the venue, there will be so much happening around you that you might feel overwhelmed, which is totally fine, but trust me, you'll get the hang of it. Take a deep breath and remember to take your time to go through the expo hall, to attend the sessions that you've picked, to go to hands-on workshops, have conversations with people, meet and network with them. Don't forget to ask questions and show that you're curious. People love talking and explaining technical concepts. They love helping out other people. One great advice is going to the AWS Community Lounge. They have it in all the summits, which is a place where the community hangs out. And, and I assure you, and I assure you, they are really, really nice. I'm, I'm one of them. <laughs> Finally, when the summit is over, remember it's not the end of your journey, it's just the beginning. So take time to reflect on your experience and what you've learned. Also, what were the key takeaways that you got from the conference? What inspired you there? Use those insights to create a blog post, to share on social media, to create a YouTube video. This is not only going to help you solidify what you've learned, but it's also going to help the community. Oh, and by the way, don't forget to follow up with the people that you met at the event. That's how you build professional relationships. That's what's called networking. So follow up with them, follow them on social media, send them a message. You never know. And trust me, they can be extremely valuable in your career. Last but not least, keep the momentum going. 
learn and explore more about AWS, watch online courses, join AWS user groups. There is so much you can do when it comes to AWS. They offer a plethora of resources, events, f games, f etc. So take advantage of that. And those were my tips. I hope they were helpful. I also have some vlogs of previous AWS summits. You should watch them just to understand how the event is. But feel free to reach out to me on social media, send me a message. I would be glad to help you or, you know, make you feel less stressed. And yeah, I'm here for you. Don't forget, if you like the video, to give it a like and subscribe to my channel. I'm going to start creating more content slowly. I know I haven't been doing a lot, but I'm here to help you. So thank you for watching and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.